Mr. Chairman, I'd like to introduce Proxy Betty Martini. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Um, I'm the founder of Mission Possible International in the United States and 50 states and 42 countries of the world. And the only thing that we do is warn people off of aspartame. This is the medical text, and it's been cut down 40%, and I can hardly carry it. I write the obituaries on the sick and dying, and Coke refuses to address this issue of aspartame disease, which is now global plague, causing seizures, MS, lupus, autism, blindness. I flew to, let's put it out a little bit, I flew to uh, Barcelona to talk to Dr. Almany, who did the Troco study that showed that the formaldehyde from the free methyl alcohol embalms living tissue. First thing he said to me, Betty Aspartame is going to kill 200 million people. I said, it probably already has. It's an abortifacient. The last three studies show it to be a multi-potential carcinogen, and uh, all the independent studies uh, uh, explain what we are seeing in the population. Uh, a man by the name of Charles Fleming died from methanol poisoning. His wife, a Sunday school teacher, was put in prison for 30 years. All experts looked at the autopsy and said he died from aspartame. Now there's another case, but people are dying all over the world. I lecture all over the world, and we're unpaid. That's all we do is try to save as many as we can. And I have told Coca-Cola for years, and Coca-Cola puts out the propaganda by industry, which has been disproven by the experts. Thank you, madam. Um, again, um, what I would say to you categorically is that if we believe there was any risk uh, to human health from any of the ingredients, including the one that you mentioned, aspartame, uh, 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 we would absolutely uh, not have it in our products, categorically. Overwhelming scientific research in all countries emerging as well as Western nations around the world indicate that based on the levels of use of that ingredient uh, as a sweetener, uh, it is, has no uh, negative implications for human health. And therefore, we rely again on scientific data as well as the opinions, clear, clear opinions of the regulatory authorities in the United States as well as all countries around the world. And it's not, not just to, uh, uh, um, confined to aspartame. It is the same level of scrutiny uh, that we use is for all ingredients across our sparkling and still beverages. And I can assure you that, again, if there was any doubt, we would not be uh, using any of that in our products. And we are absolutely assured of the safety.